Now, News 18 Sports. The Eau Claire Regis baseball team hit its stride at the perfect time this season and now just two wins from a state championship. Ramblers taking on Coleman in the state semis. They started off strong. Pitcher Cole Selvig with a deep shot to left. The left fielder can't track it down. He stumbles. A runner scores from second. Regis leads 3-2 after one. In the third, Caden Weber squeaks it up the middle to drive in another. Regis extends the lead to two. Bottom of the frame was the turning point. Coleman's Noah Noskovitz grounds it to second. Ball gets away. A run comes in, and the lead is cut down to one. Same inning, Tyler Blanchard with an identical hit. Two more score for Coleman. They would score four in the third inning, and that was the decider. Regis falls six to four in the semis. Evan Hong spoke with the team after the game. Regis had tons of momentum heading into the state tournament, winning eight of the last nine games since May 28th. They had the opportunity to kill the momentum of the number one team in Division Three in the semis, but it just wasn't their day. And we had them on the ropes. Um, but, you know, it sounds like a cliche, but that, that's just how baseball works sometimes. But none of the players hung their heads after the game. They're just glad to be here in the first place. At this moment is disappointing, but but overall, it's there's a lot to be happy about. If you asked us during the middle of the year if we would be at State, uh, a lot of people would have laughed. We had a really rough stretch during, like, let's say, like the middle of our season, but... I don't know, we picked it up and everybody just kind of banded together. A big reason for the team's success came from the underclassmen. Sophomores took the mound in every playoff game. Yeah, we have a lot of sophomore talent and a lot of juniors that are going to be good too. Every kid who's here today and coming back is going to be better because of today. It was 14 years between state tournament appearances for the Ramblers, but with the talent that they have returning, there's a good chance it won't take that long to reach the next one. From Appleton, Evan Hong, News 18 Sports. The Blair Taylor Wildcats are at the state for the fourth time since 2017, still in search for the title. Blair Taylor taking on Judah Albany this morning. Judah Albany opens the scoring. Gracie, free tag, splits the gap. Two runs scored, part of a four run inning. But Blair Taylor has been here before. Here comes Abby Thompson. She gets the bloop single to right. It falls in front of the right fielder. Two runs come home to score. Wildcats now within four to two. Sixth inning now, six to three. Sydney Smith, she finds the hole. Kirsten Kinchy is in, six to four. Here come the Cats. Judah Albany keeps hitting. Avery Briggs doubles to left. Panthers score in each of the final four frames. Last call for Blair Taylor. Olivia Bow delivers a single to right. Cats are within seven to five, but run out of time. Judah Albany advances to the D4 championship game with a seven to five win.